Set for a start, race seven pale. Here they go, racing in the Sports Toto Supreme Challenge Cup. Cheval Rapid stepped away well. Gingerella, she came out like a startled gazelle and she clears them into the first turn. Gingerella, Violet's up to second. Now moving around the outside there is uh, Eclipse Splash and Die Guys in the centre from White Hoof Bird. Then Kung Fu Panda back to midfield there with Cheval Rapid. Then War Dragon, Black Thorn. Then came Shanghai Knights, who's a fair way off them as well. Uh, just ahead there is Handsome Benz. And last of all, Skydance Eclipse approaching the home turn now. And Gingerella inside the half-mile marker led the way now from Violet, who's about a length and a half away in second placing. Then came I Guy around White Hoof Bird, Eclipse Splash, uh, is out three deep at this stage, but drifting out of it now from Cheval Rapide, Kung Fu Panda, War Dragon, Handsome Benz, Blackthorn to the outside, and then Shanghai Knights, but down the lane, 400 left to go. This mare travels well, Gingerella. She's extending the margin from Violet. Now White Hoof Birds, dust a knuckle down. War Dragon, Kung Fu Panda, and Blackthorn is winding up. White Hoof Bird now goes up and hits the leader, draws away from Gingerella. Then Violet down the outside, War Dragon. Shanghai Knights is coming with a late surge as well. It's White Hoof Bird clear. White Hoof Bird, Skydance Eclipse runs to second, but White Hoof Bird too good. White Hoof Bird has one from Skydance Eclipse and War Dragon. Then Gingerella. They were followed by Handsome Benz and then Blackthorn. Further back to Kung Fu Panda who failed to come on in the home straight. Uh, back with him was Violet, Cheval Rapide. Uh, then came I Guy pulling up quickly there with Shanghai Knights and Eclipse Splash was back at the tail. So White Hoof Bird takes out the Sports Toto Supreme Challenge Cup. And uh, another horse with a very good record here in the country. He's had 15 starts for eight wins here in Malaysia. And uh, coming off a freshen up and was second up this afternoon. So he's done a good job, White Hoof Bird, ridden by the apprentice R. Nukeman. Posting a win today and improving and improving that very uh, handy statistic since he made his debut here two seasons ago. Now Skydance Eclipse has rattled home into second placing a good effort there by Skydance Eclipse. And third goes the way of War Dragon and the early pacemaker Gingerella. Uh, she was found uh, wanting in the closing stages but has held on for fourth I'd say as we await the numbers after race seven. So White Hoof Bird, the six-year-old gelding by Denman from Can She Move, raced by the 95 Emperor Stable, trained by S.Y. Lim and ridden by R. Nukeman, defeats number five Skydance Eclipse, trained by Frank Maynard and ridden by R. Reuven, 33. Now the margins are two by a length and a quarter by three quarters, so two by a length and a quarter by three quarters, and 122.8 the time, 122.8 was the winner's time. Gee, Cheval Rapid got crowded there for room just after the start, bouncing off the inside rail. Gingerella had to work hard from her outside barrier. And gee, there was a bit of tightening up towards the, uh, the first bend. Uh, Violet was up there early, eye guy, but they both dropped away at the finish. White Hoof Bird travelled well he was about fifth in the run in the all white colours and had a lovely trip in transit just coasting along Cheval Rapid was back midfield Kung Fu Panda failed to run on as well he was always well back Blackthorn peeled to the outside with Shanghai Knights but uh, in the meantime the others just simply stole a break as they travelled down the straight and Skydance Eclipse was probably the best of the back markers working home nicely into second placing, of course, the uh, Piala Remus coming up for him, I'd say. As we stand by for the numbers, they're through 4, 5, 12 and 3, 122.8 the time after race 7.